Hello everybody, I am back. So, I don't like doing live videos because anything can happen. So this, I was finna go live, but then everything started going wrong. So my video will be into different parts because I'm using my phone. So what we're gonna do today, we're gonna reupholster this little ornament thing. So I got three different fabrics. So I have this red fabric, I thought about it. Okay. So, see this red, but when I do this, I realize I don't have enough for the bottom. Y'all see the bottom? So this red would not work. So I'm gonna save this for some pillows. So I got some pillows I picked up from Walmart. I'm gonna use a hot glue gun and this would be pillows. So the second one I thought about was this brown. Like, uh, looks like leather, but it's not, or patent leather or something. So I thought about this brown to put on there. I definitely have enough with this, but then when I looked at it, I'm like, ah, uh, it would go great in the living room, but I wanted it upstairs for my little sewing room so I can sit down and put my shoes on. So I'm like, no, I don't want to use it for that. And then this was my final favorite. Y'all see this? And this one really pops. I love this one. So I decided on this particular one. So I have my electrical staple gun, and that is the one that I am going to use. So what I've been thinking about is I want to make this one right, and then y'all see how that is. I think instead of folding it under, I think I want to have it where it's drooping like that. So let's get this. This is my first time using this one too. So it's a little complicated to use because I don't think I was doing it right. So... I think I got to do that and turn it. Do I got it on? Let's see, this is a little that way. I'm not for sure. See how to use this one. I'll get my little other one. I'll be in business. So let me try it again. There we go. I'm not for sure. You know, I know it's scared to death hearing that noise. So, I'm going to get on over here. So, I'm trying to lift it up as much as I can and get over to that side. And then down at the bottom, I think I want to leave it kind of pleated, not necessarily tuck it under like how normally... You would do it. So, you got that side. Now I'm gonna move it over here and get this side. So when I get over here, I'm gonna tuck it in a little bit. Y'all see that when I got to the corner? Tuck that in a little bit. So when I get ready, staple it. So. So, tuck it, I'm tucking it to where I want it, and definitely, um, if you have it, your piece cut and measured out, I'm just going off the hip, like live, so none of this is, I didn't do any measurements normally, if you want to be like 100% precise, you can measure this part out and make it like perfect, and as y'all can see, I didn't do any of that. So, I'm still just now prepping it to go around. I'm trying to get as close as I can up in there. So, I'm trying to get as close as I can. So, now I'm going to do this side right here. Staple it trim the ends, and I'm going to stop the video and come back to the next side. 